Hey guys, in this video, we are going to install Android 9.5 on your Xiaomi Redmi Note 5, the Redmi 5 Plus, which is a single cam variant for our uh, Redmi Note 5 family. And yeah, finally, an Android 9.0 on your Xiaomi Redmi Note 5 or a Redmi 5 Plus. So, without wasting more time, let's start with the installation. So, guys, in order to install Android 9.0 on your Xiaomi Redmi Note 5 or the Redmi 5 Plus, which is a single cam variant. So you will just need to get bootloader unlock and the TDBR pin need to be installed. So you just need to do these things and then continue with this part. So if you haven't done this of the things like unlocking the bootloader, installing TDRP, you can just watch my two of these videos which I already made. Now you just need to go into the RWRP or TDRP, whatever you have, and you need the treble recovery. So the link are in the description and just boot into recovery mode using the volume up and the power button. Okay, so it's again showing the my logo. It will boot up into the recovery mode, and you need treble recovery, so you can either install the RWRP recovery or the TWRP treble recovery. I have the RWRP recovery, as you can see, the Red Wolf recovery, and you can even install anyone, but you just need a treble version of the recovery. I just let's reduce the brightness, just increase it some. Okay, this is good okay focus also good now first of all just wipe off your older data if you want to get a backup you can just take a backup add one swipe dalvik cage data system vendor that's it nothing else to wipe let's then go back go to install now you have to download all of the files mentioned in the description so first flash the cardinal usb treble now that the ROM gets flashed, go back, go to install and you need to click on install image and you need to install this PR1. All of the links will be in the description so don't worry. This is the main Android Pi PR1 GSI you are going to flash. So it's a system image and that's why you need the TWRP treble recovery or the RWRP treble which I am using. So yeah, all of the links will be in the description so don't hesitate to take a look at it so guys our main pi gsi is also installed and now go to install you need to flash this post gsi's okay start from the number one add the second and the third one too so flash these in order oh sorry uh, i really forgot now many of you will do directly just mount vendor and if it's already just unmount and mount oh sorry uh, like see mistakes happen now just flash this post gsis now yes uh, the same thing might have happened to you guys and now you can see uh, the uh, patches are been getting installed so this is how it is done now many of the guys from the redmi note 5 pro video complained me the mount vendor is not mounted i know it already is mounted just unmount and do it now we have to flash some fixes which is the gcam fix and the PR1 lag fix and the voltage fix so you need to fix flash the voltage fix from the first boot only and no need to install magic at the first boot you need to again boot in power power off and then reboot into recovery and then flash magic so, and yes this is a reboot system and just wait till the google boot animation comes up and guys yes here is the google boot animation and i know because of the screen's brightness everything has gone dark so yeah let's let it boot i will just like increase the uh, like increase some of the brightness set it up and then we'll show you how to completely set it up and installing the g apps uh, like the google services update everything i will be showing you so guys the device has been booted so first let's go into settings and yes this is android pi yeah at first boot the device will be somehow slow slow means opening those apps and as you can see this is android 9 and this is pr1 so it means the first pi release uh, like which google pixel has the same you guys have on your redmi note for the redmi 5 plus which is the android pi yes it's finally flash and also it has all of the things working like voltage and everything as you can see you can see this hd icon which is also termed as voltage on aosps and lt hd means hd calls which is like LTE, view LTE, voice on LTE. So, yeah. so guys, now before moving forward, we need to update the G, uh, GMS, sorry, 
GPS which is the Google Play services not the location wala GPS so yeah you need to just open the file manager until it opens fully so just keep trying opening I will also keep try opening it you say at the first put it's a pain uh, to open all of many of these apps but yeah also the Google apps won't work because the G apps or sorry the Google Play services is like lower version we need to update it so yeah I will just update it wait and guys finally after many tries I have this opened which is the file manager USB file manager now let's just update the G apps sorry Google Play services so that the Play Store will start working and you need to add your Google account in it so yeah you can install apps and all of this stuff now after installing the Google Play services install also this digital well-being if you want now this is just it will show you the daily stats uh, so it's like battery usage stats your unlocks and the what else so it will show you many such things here so yeah also install this done and yeah all of here now the normal part is done everything's done you can now access the play store uh, let me show you and it will ask for your uh, gmail and sign in and you can sign in and you can install all of your apps and yes this is fully stable as you can see all wi-fi everything is working also these messages will be gone gone after you start the play store and all account sign in and everything other process and yeah you can just also uh, like fix this by just reducing the display size so just go to the display and reduce the display size to small and this is how it looks now it looks really cool like the pixel one and yes this is how to install android 9.0 pi on your redmi note 5 or the redmi 5 plus with a single cam variant of the redmi note 5 family and if you find any bugs or doubts you can just comment down below in the comment section and Goodbye guys, this was for the video and if you have any doubts regarding the installation, please PM, uh, sorry not PM, comment down below and you can find me on Telegram as not allowed on Telegram, you can PM there. So, bye bye guys, I will see you guys in the next video, till then, bye bye.